Uh, yeah, huh? yeah, okay. We, we needed to go uh, collecting up the local fauna. Is that the term? It's flora and fauna, right? And flora has to be plants, so fa fauna has to be local wildlife. Theoretically. Definitely. Objectively. I'm correct. I'm correct. Don't don't question me. We need to get some fish, is my point. We need some, some cool ass new fish to give to that strange man so he can make bait for uh, the weird monsters he wants to kill. I, I, I guess I get it. Like... The, the weird monsters don't seem like overly threatening in this area, especially compared to the previous couple of areas. But at the same time, they did like kill his friends, so I get why he, you know, he doesn't really want them to exist in his vicinity anymore. I I see his point. That it got dark real quick. Did I not start this at the beginning of the day? Did I start in the middle of the day for some reason? That's, Oh, a really bizarre way of doing things, Joe. It's not what you should be doing, I don't think. I honestly can't remember, well, I, I didn't have any clue whatsoever, honestly, what, what fish I needed for this dude, but I'm going to bring these two that I've just got now to him. Um, see if he's interested in these. And if not, then we'll know not to catch them again, won't we? Lesson learned. That was a short ass day, man. Um, yeah, this this weighs this weighs him, I think. Is it? I feel like that wasn't the way we came in last time, but you know, this place this place changes. Ah, oh, see, that's something new. Let's grab one of these as well. That's like an eel of some sort. A long, thin eel. Yeah, it's it's quite long. It's quite a long eel. I've seen shorter eels, I'll be honest. Hello, Airman. Uh, dog about bait in the traps? Uh, this because the bait for the first one. You need these? Yeah, you need these. Cool, we just need a big long toothbrush face now. And that, that's the first one done. Yeah, I know I don't. Let me, let me, let me work, alright? Let me cook. Beautiful. That's some sort of catfish. Distinctive silhouettes on both the ones we're missing so far. And the last one. Eels! Okay, we can grab another eel for you. We'll grab another eel for you. That's all for now. That's everything. Let me just grab you another eel real quick, friend. He's gonna love this eel so much. This is a man who knows who knows his eels, you know. This is a man who is infinitely infinitely respectful of the bounties of the water. You can tell because he's an airman. Which is you might think that's like the, the polar opposite of being a boatman. You might think that's like he's 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 up in the sky instead of down in the water, but are they not one and the same? Where does the sea meet the horizon, eh? It's just, just the endless blue, isn't it, right? Just the endless blue. <laughs> Have an eel, my friend. Have an eel. Get it down, you. Yeah. I should do it. I'll just mix these in here, load this into a trap, and then get well clear from it. When the trap springs, we'll fire it upon the mortar. Make sure you bring back proof that the thing's really dead, you hear? Uh, that's all for now. I want to get all three baits before I start blowing shit up, but I can rest here, so that seems like a sensible thing to do. A duck. So we need to look for toothbrush face and catfish looking thing. Also maybe buy some explosives. Maybe buy some boom booms. Grab this for sure, whatever it is. I have forgotten the way out. Is it? It's got to be this way, right? Has to be. Legally, has to be. A lot of creaking noises going on right now. Can those chill?
Hey, buy my fish. Hey, buy my fish. Hey, buy my fish. Thank you. I'm just gonna pop that off while I'm here as well. Right, okay, cool. Let's go find some fish. Let's go find some really cool, really cool wacky things. Do you have toothbrush face? You do! Well, that's convenient. Grab a few of these, see if they're worth anything. I just heard something make a big splashy sound. I don't know if that means I'm about to get assaulted. Discovering that I can get assaulted while fishing is the most upsetting thing. On oh, Look at him, he's a happy fella. He's a grinning gar. Muscular gums grow and force cracking teeth against each other. Softer flesh tears from the strain. Look how happy he is. It may sound like he's in constant agonizing pain, but look, look at him. He's grinning. How could, how could he be? How could he possibly be in a bad way? Um, I feel like I've been stacking these a little bit wrong, if I'm honest. I feel like maybe my, uh, my storage strategies aren't quite working in the ideal way. Oh, I still can't fit them all in. Fuck. Aha. Let's just put that there. There we go. In fact, yeah, I can catch one more. So why am I not doing that? God, there's so many. Oh no, I have just depleted it now. I was going to say, there seem to be so fucking many of them there. Considering how big they are, you expect there to only be like three or four of them maybe in a... I forgot to buy the explosives. Uh, yeah, three or four of them in a... in a single pool, school locale, but got quite a few of those fuckers. Uh, I've got another thing for you. Uh, was it the first one that wanted these guys? I think it was, right? I should do it, mix this, blah blah blah, put the big bat proof, yep, yeah. okay, cool. That's all for now. That's everything. That's why I said that's all for now. One of those people that you just can't get out of a conversation with, you know? Like, yeah, that's great, man. I'll catch up with you later. And then they just keep talking. And you're like, well, well, look, I've got things to do, man. Let me, let me just, let me just get on with that, and uh, I'll, uh, I'll get back to you on that, yeah. And they'll keep talking. <laughs> just trying, desperately trying to detach yourself from the conversation, but something is happening behind me, and I don't like it. Hello, I bought you some really fun fish. I bought you these really... Look, $333 worth. What a haul. What a genuine haul that is. Uh, I want to go to the shipyard. I want to buy explosives. Ah, I see. She has a limited stock. It makes me more tempted to buy things when they're in limited stock, you know? Like, if I could just buy endless research parts from her, I'd be like, eh, whatever, I just won't bother. But if now that I know I can only buy, like, these things once, suddenly it's, like, so much more tempting to me, you know? Um, I do have 800 big boys right now. Can't actually fit that light in. Can I afford my big cool... I can afford my big cool engine. We should get that set up, I think. Oh, what? Send it to storage, we'll sort it out from there. And was there a, no, there wasn't a rod we currently needed. We're still researching towards the other rod, aren't we? Uh, let's go to my storage. If we just get this out of the way for a second. I think we can get this and this installed, right? If I uninstall this one... Install this one... And then reinstall this one... 
Now we should be going fucking... F I mean, it's four in the morning. That was a lot of work I had to do there, but... We should be going pretty fast. I don't know if it's worth sleeping more. I really don't know, like, how sanity works in this game. Because I, I literally just slept for an hour and 40 minutes, which doesn't seem like a good enough sleep. I think maybe I'll just do that. Just get him a couple more hours. Just in case that helps. Oh, okay, we are motoring now, holy fuck. I'm gonna crash so much now that, <laughs> now that I'm going this fast. Let's see if we can find a, a catfish thing then. Nyom. Yo, just more toothbrush faces. To be fair, those sell really well. I made some serious moolah off those fellas. What are you? Not what I'm looking for. I don't know if I've caught one of them before. I probably should have grabbed one just in case. Fill out my encyclopedia a bit, but... I've left now. Oh. This wasn't the thing I was going to blow up, but fuck it, let's do it. The debris crumbles away. Crocodile! Okay, I mean, I've definitely not caught one of these before, so... Big lad, look at him. Goliath tigerfish. I feel like I needed one. That, there was a dude somewhere who was like, hey, catch, catch me a Goliath tigerfish, wasn't there? Wasn't that a thing? Did I dream that? I'm assuming the big crocodiles aren't actually threats. I don't know, I, I, I'm not going to just, like, ride over one just in case, but... I think they are just scenery, to be fair. What are you? Not what I want. What are you? Not what I want. What are you? Also not what I want. Getting a little better at recognising them just from their, their models without having to actually interact. I mean, free stuff. Needed some of this shit actually, didn't I? Can't remember exactly where we stand on the upgrades, but I'm sure more of these will be useful. a little bit late. I should probably be concerned. I don't think this place is any more dangerous during the night particularly though, right? It seems to do all of its shenanigans during the day as well, so like... It's only really the sanity thing that I need to be concerned about, I think. That's not what I'm looking for. Just go a little bit further afield. I mean, they might be ocean fish, is what I'm thinking. Like, they might not be actually in the place I'm checking at the moment. I'll fish whatever that is, though. If you're going to be shiny in my vicinity, you're going to get caught, my friend. I mean, that's all I've got room for. And it wasn't particularly special, so... A little bit sad about that. I had a light for a second there. Momentarily, there was light. It's fine. Destination achieved. Making some cash here, it's gotta be said. This this is this is definitely the place to come if I want to get rich, I think. Threats aren't particularly threatening. And just lots of expensive fish everywhere. Can I uh crack on with the floating dock stuff? Actually can perfectly. Look at that. 
almost like God intended it. What's up next then? Two wood, two cloth. I'm sure I can sort that out. And then three wood, a cloth, and a, a metal scrap. Alright. Uh, rest. And a little bit longer, just because I don't... I, do, I still don't understand how... Yeah, as I said, I do, do not get how sanity works at all. Like, I don't know if sleeping one hour just fixes it, or if you need to, like... If there is, like, a hidden sanity progress bar somewhere that you need to... You need to sort of mitigate... God. The extra speed is nice, but god damn it does make steering more difficult. Because I, like, I let go of the button there. Like, oh, hello. Continue floating for like a while after you release the button. So like when you're trying to do tight maneuvers like this, it, it becomes more about like tapping it than holding it. Okay, well I do need the wood, I suppose. I guess. I think I might be in danger. Do I bail? Is he coming for me? He popped up and roared, but I think I don't think he's bothered about me taking this wood, to be honest. I think he's okay with this. I think if he had an issue with it, I would already be fucked. I knew it wasn't those, but I clicked it anyway. You never know. I think we're looking for some, like, big fish. I think they're large, what we're looking for here. It's going to be fairly clear that it's not just one of these little schools, you know. I need more explosives, man. It's at least two places I still need to blow up around here. I've been over here yet. Is this anything? Sounded threatening. Again, not actually coming for me though. He's just making his presence felt, you know. All bark, no bite. And I'll keep saying these things right up until he rips my boat in half. Hey, there we go. What did I learn from that? Oh, I'll find out what I learned from that. Uh, what even was it? I, did, I didn't even read what it was. Plan for the future? Is it that? I feel like we already had a fish stocks one, but... Yeah, we already had sustainable fishing. Now we got a plan for the future, so... Cool. Hey! What I bumblefucked my way into. Might as well keep fishing. Can I get another one in here? It doesn't seem likely, does it? But let me just. No, I think I think we're going with no on that. <laughs> I think no is the correct answer. Uh, where do I want to be? Is this the right direction? Kind of looks like the right direction. There we go. I knew that would happen sooner or later. So difficult. Oh, these mushrooms have collision. I, I didn't even realise that. I did not realise the mushrooms had collision. I just 
hadn't tried swimming through one, I guess. Alright, dude, chill. Chill, my good friend. No need for the hostilities now. I'm going the wrong way now, but he's kind of... He's kind of guarding that direction, so I, I suppose I should probably try and find a different way out. It'd be really cool if I could blow that up, wouldn't it? You know what? I'm probably faster than him. <laughs> Literal millimeters from crashing into that, then. I, I, feel the need to move fast because I feel like something's chasing me. Oh, okay, we're here. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think that might have been a sanity thing, to be fair. I've not seen that happen before. Hmm. Here, buy this. I wish I could just do that to sell. I really do. Because having to press F to sell fish when F is also the sell all button when you don't have a fish selected is th it's the worst controls Th the worst no controls have been worse than that ever they've cornered the market on shitty concepts uh, floating dock it keeps being so perfect it keeps falling into place so well I don't need the extra net spaces because I don't fucking use nets, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to go to the shipyard again. I wanted to buy two of these. Oh. No, I didn't, I guess. No, I didn't. I wanted to rest for maybe a bit longer than half. Yeah, I've still got the eyeball. Uh, maybe there's still like a lidded thing there. I don't know if that's just how it looks when you're not. Yeah, that's just how it looks all the time. Okay, fair enough. Probably should have done some repairs. I did take a little bit of a a little bit of a crash bash back there, but I don't think it's too serious. I think this is just a shortcut through to another place I've already been, but I'm going to blow it up anyway. Just having more routes I can go around here is gonna be is gonna be nice. Given that the routes tend to open and close at random anyway, you know. Hello there, buddy. The last fish, it's complete. Alright. So where do I put the bait? I, I know it's those shriny things, but... One of the traps marked on your map. Oh, he's marked them on my map now. That's actually really helpful. Thank you. There, there, and there. Should be easy enough. I don't know what I need to do beyond just placing the bait there. I don't know if the rest of it is, is just, like, down to him. Or if there's more to it than that. Is it this way? Yeah, it's sort of this way. This will work. This will get me where I need to be. All roads lead to Rome, as they say. A large cage is suspending over the water. A small receptacle is floating underneath. Load bait. You should probably move away. Alright, see you later. You want the bait? You want the bait, buddy? Oh, look at him. He's a hungry little fella. Oh, fuck. It feels kind of cruel. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Like, considering these guys have done literally nothing to me. You're, the rest of the carcass is out of sight. Okay. Yeah, considering these guys have, like, not... They've barely been hostile. Like, okay, they, they occasionally raised some walls in front of me, and one did chase me very briefly. But that's it. Like... <laughs> if 
feel like I'm just hunting the majestic beasts of the region. Excuse me, pal. Part of me does want to hang out and see what happens, see if I can get myself blown up, but... Another part of me is slightly less stupid than that, so... It's not usually the predominant part. But it is a part. There is a bit of me deep down that behaves sensibly. It's night time now and I gotta go through the mushroom, so this is gonna be fun, but Oh, it's this way. Struggle with sense of direction in this area. It's almost like it's designed that way. Almost like it was intended as a maze. Where's the trap? Oh there it is. I'm out ski. In my fucking speedboat. <laughs> Rest in peace, you noble beast. Hunted to extinction. For what crime? Defending their territory? And not even doing that particularly fervently. <laughs> I don't know if that means the vines are going to stop. I don't know if it's them that are controlling the vines. So the vines will stop blocking me off now. I've been assuming that... What the fuck was that? I've been assuming that that was the case. But, um... Okay. Yeah. The vines are still doing... The vines are still doing their thing. That's just... The plant life of the area, I guess. It just, uh. It just does that naturally. I'd quite like to just go hand the quest in, but I. Oh! Okay, I guess I can go this way. Yeah. All right, ominous musical stings. All right, eyeballs floating in the background. I know, I know I'm staying up late. I'm being a bad boy. <laughs> Way past my bedtime and I've got school in the morning. I understand. I just wanted to hand my quest in, if that's okay. How are things going? Uh, I have a creature corpse to show you. Well, let's see it then. You hand the tattered lump of flesh over to the airman. It's almost unrecognizable, but you both know it couldn't have belonged to anything else. He pokes at it with his knife, testing the rubbery meat. He seems satisfied. Yes, this is one of the beasts. Progress at last, more to go though. Oh, you have more. You drop the flesh onto the ground and it gives a few slashes with the knife. It wobbles a little. Another one taken care of. One remains by my count. Let's finish this. Oh, you have more? You drop the large bloodied carcass in front of the M and his eyes fill with sadistic delight. He bends down and plunges his knife into the soft flesh. It falls away before the blade, revealing a glint of metal. With a sickening tear, he rests it from where it was embedded in the flesh of the creature. He holds it aloft. You recognize it as a necklace, glistening in gore. Well, fisherman, some fortune at last. This ought to fetch a decent price from the right collector. Here, why don't you take it? Okay, well, that's convenient, isn't it? <laughs> I wondered where we were going to get this. He stands back from the corpse. A melancholic look comes over his face. And now, well, that's that, I suppose. Hmm? So what will you do now? Can't stay, for sure. I thought I'd be asking you for an escort away from this place, but this has become somewhat of a home for me. Oh, I can't say for sure. That, <laughs> that makes more sense. It doesn't feel right to leave my brothers here. I think I shall stay a while longer. You're just going to live at this crash site, are you? Okay, well, whatever does it for you. Obviously didn't have a lot of family ties back home. In the meantime, I can make some special bait for you. Or to help with your fishing. Hmm? What's this about bait? Yeah, this was left over from the other bait we made. We used to attract all manner of nearby species. Okay. I'll hold on to that, I guess. Right now, we can make some fresh stuff if you like. I need some fish from you first, any type will do, but the more you give me, the more bait I can make. Okay. 
So I guess this is a thing I can do now. I can trade my fish up to make bigger fish that we can then sell for more, but that's everything. And I would like to rest here, thank you. Now, I'm aware that I have the fast travel thing to get me home. I don't think I'm going to use it. That's just not how I like playing the game. I want to make the journey, you know. But first... Okay. It's an easier way of getting these. Not that I specifically need these anymore, but... I imagine they sell fairly well, being quite large and quite rare. Oh, this is not what I was expecting. It's a sergeant fish. And also this. Seems like these have a higher chance of being trophy fish as well. Tarpon. Okay, so you get a sort of mixed bag from doing that. That's interesting. I'm probably not going to bother with that mechanic much unless I like specifically need to. There's like a fish I can't catch outside of doing that. I'm assuming I'm going to be able to have bait made in other places as well. It's not just going to be that guy now. I'm not going to have to come all the way back here every time I want any. But maybe I'm wrong. She's not offering the service at least. Uh, can you... Can you... Oh, I don't actually need any repairs. Okay, fair enough then. She's selling two of these now. Kind of tempted to start picking them up. Haven't found any research parts in a bit. I did want to grab this and this. Because those are the only two rods I'm ever going to need, right? They, they cover all seven between them. But I need seven research parts to get them both. That's going to take some time. Uh, we'll think about it. We'll think about it. In the meantime, let's begin our much quicker route home. To be fair, not checked this island yet. Or these islands, I don't think. Might be worth just seeing what they're all about. Remember, my boat's a lot fast now. It's a lot fast, he says. A lot faster. So hopefully, we'll be able to do a few bits and still make it home in time. And even if we don't, we can probably just outrun the threats anyway. Hey, dog tag. God damn it, I need to go back in now. <laughs> That's fine. It's fine. I'm not mad. I see how it works now, though. If we see a crashed plane, we're probably going to find dog tags there. You know, outside of the ones that we already had to fish out for the quest. Like it gets dark earlier, earlier and earlier, you know. Six o'clock, sun's gone down. What season is this? What are you guys? Are you something cool? Or are you just more of those? I'm not going to grab you just now. Oh what? Oh what? Oh what? Oh what? Is it? chasing me? What the fuck was that? I'm just gonna, just gonna grab this research part if that's okay. Does it always do that when I approach? It's a big crab! Okay, he's actually kinda cool. He's actually kind of neat. I like him, to be fair. To be fair to the big crab. Like, yeah, okay. Pretty spooky. Caught me off guard the first time, but looking, looking back at him. Gets a thumbs up from me. I approve of the big crab. I wish he didn't scream like a man, but aside from that, I can, I can get on board with him. Well, I can't. That's the problem. He, he 
he keeps moving the boat out of my reach, so I definitely can't get on board with him, but haha, ba dum bum, tish. My uh, attempt to leave this place didn't go super well. <laughs> Hello again. <laughs> Right, just need one cloth and one scrap. It almost looks like I'm remembering exactly how much of everything I need. The fact that it always seems to be perfect when I come to drop it off. But I assure you, it is pure luck. Mm. Do I have any fish to sell? No, I didn't have jack shit to sell, man. Didn't have jack shit to sell. I do have research to do, though. Let's get the fathomless winch first, just because it's cheaper. I would love to get the versatile rod. To be fair, I probably should have got that first so that I don't have to bother buying a heat-resistant line, which I'm definitely going to need in the next zone. That was a misstep on my part. I don't make many. I'm pretty flawless most of the time, but... I'm a big enough man to own up to my, ex my mistakes, you know? And that may have been one of them. The thing is now, sunk cost, isn't it? Like, I've, I've already put one point in that. I only need two more to complete it. Whereas I need four to get the other thing. How's things going? Found some dog tags. Let me see. Boop. Presumably you can return multiple at once, but... Uh, thank you. I hung them on the tree. Here, as promised. Beautiful, thank you. This guy is... I mean, okay, he's fairly easy to get to within this zone, but he's so far away from everything else on the map. Like, having to come all the way out here if I want to get bait or handing dog tags is... Why could he not just get on my boat and come with me? Bring his dog tags with him and hang him on a different tree, you know? Like, why is he so tied to that tree specifically? I want to check these islands, including this far distant one out in the arse end of nowhere. Because let's face it, if it's fucking miles away from anything, it's probably got something interesting on it. Probably one of those hooded dudes, actually, in all honesty. A bloke in a different robe who wants to eat a specific fish. This will drop us basically back at the research lab again, so I guess I can I can rest there if I uh, if it's getting to that time when I arrive, which I expect it will be. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> more dog tags. Almost guarantee it's more dog tags. Oh. No, it's a sextant. Okay. Thanks, I guess. Can inspect the... Why is everything a grab now? Hey, why is everything a crab now? <laughs> that sextant feels like it's something though, right? That feels almost like a quest item. I don't know who I would take that to. I guess maybe the scientist lady? What have we got over here then? Fish? Some scrap. A fancy boot. <laughs> of course. What else would it have been? Is that it around here? Certainly looks like it. These islands are pretty disappointing, actually. Thought I'd find something cooler than this, but... Never mind. And the shiny fish school's gone away. That's a shame. Alright, we'll head back here. Rest up with our old friend and the dog. Hopefully she's still doing okay. Nothing bad's happened to her while I've been gone. You know, she's still living right by a ridiculously oversized giant killer squid. But, you know. It's not quite late enough to justify resting yet. Let's catch some stupid mouth fish. 
think stupid mouth fish would have sold a lot better than big mouth bass, to be honest. Think of the marketing opportunities for that. Not only is it a horrifying thing that you can... It's a fucking skeleton. A few ragged scraps of skin hanging like cobwebs from its fins. Its exposed muscles are riddled with small white worms. Yummy. Yeah, not only would this be like a horrifying thing to hang on your wall and scare kids, but it's called Stupid Mouth Fish. I mean, that's what I call it anyway. So, like... That's a much funnier name than Big Mouth Bass. I think what what fun song it could sing. It, who knows? I have to put some market research into deciding what the uh, best option would be for that. You got anything to add, researcher? Oh, hello again. What do you need? Um, nothing. Just wanted to see the dog. Look at the little bone. Look at him go. Right, we're off again. That was it. So that I believe covers three out of four of the peripheral islands, leaving us only one left to do. I get the feeling we're rapidly advancing on the end of this game. I believe there's still two more of the items left to find. So I'm assuming we're going to get the one in the top right and then there'll be like a final item. Possibly. Possibly on the Marrows themselves, or it might become more of a, like, a new island could rise from the depths on the back of Cthulhu or some shit, you know? <laughs> Who knows how they could play it. It's going to be not horrifying at all finding out, though. Let's grab a couple of fish while I'm here. Is that a swordfish? Did I ever catch a swordfish? I, I'm not going to catch one now. <laughs> I also forgot how full my inventory was, so there's probably not a great deal of point fishing right now. You enter the house carrying the ornate necklace. The collector recognizes it almost immediately. Ah, an excellent find. It demands price. It demands pride of place in my collection. He sweeps aside some scraps on a dusty table, candle wax pooling in its corners. He places the necklace carefully in the clearing. And I suppose you'll be demanding recompense as well. Once more he opens his book, dust pouring from the pages as he reads aloud. How is it still so dusty? He keeps reading from it. You begin to feel weak, but you're rooted to the spot, knees on the verge of buckling. As he finishes speaking, instantly harvest an entire shoulder of fish, holy shit. As he finishes speaking, you feel blood rushing back to your legs. A strange feeling of power grows in your chest. We're so close. One more remains. I loathe to suggest it, but the abyssal plane in the, on the approach to the devil's spine is a likely candidate. See what you can find. Apparently there is only one left. I thought there were two. I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? Are you human? Your inquiry is met with a piercing glaze. <laughs> glaze. <laughs> Never mind. Why, of course, as human as you are. Anything else? Alright, well, nothing. I'll be going. I'll be going. Thanks for the ability to instantly harvest a fish. I need to try this, man. I need to try this. Where is it? This one. I'm not going to do it now because I've got a full inventory, but I'll sell up and then I'll come just like destroy a school of fish. I don't know if there's like downsides to doing this though. I mean, I know the uh, the boost overheats your engines if you use it too much. I don't know if it's going to be similar for the other abilities because I've just not used them. I'm surprised the lighthouse keeper hasn't come to see me. She normally does that after I visit my strange mansion man. Don't know why I came into here. Don't know why I came into here at all. Force of habit, I think. Um, hello. Buy my fish. Thank you. I guess maybe that is just something that's just going to sell. Maybe. As I say, we have sunk the cost into the fallacy now, so... Might as well get this finished off.
Hey, school of fish. Huh. It does appear like God himself is mad at me for this. But look at all the fish I got. Look at all these fish. That seems fine. That doesn't seem like a problem. Let's do it again. Oh, I can't. It's like a once per day thing. Who knows? On cooldown, it says. Oh, I see. I see the cooldown ticking up now. Um, let's uh, get some shit vended then. Actually, not much shit to vend at the moment. Everything that's left in here is just a map or a uh, boat part, so. Which, as we have established, you can't seem to vend in this game because it's stupid. You can only vend them if you have them in your inventory. Well, you can install them in your boat and then take them to a vendor and uninstall them and sell them, but that's so stupid. <laughs> that's such a dumb way of doing things. Cool. Um, I guess I'll sell off the big school of fish I just I just murdered as well. We should hopefully still have time to get to the new location as well. Just because of how much faster my boat is than before. Shall we then? I haven't properly explored these islands, to be fair. These ones right here. Obviously I've been around Steel Point, but there's these ones just behind them, and then a bunch of other bits and pieces as well. I think I'll just motor towards the quest objective for now though, unless I see something super interesting. Like a little campsite. SOS? I'm saved! I'm saved! Oh, you are a sight for sore eyes! You look terrible, are you okay? I bet I do! I've certainly felt better. I've been chewing on seaweed and starfish for longer than I'd like. I washed up here, oh, it must be some two weeks ago now. We were in rough seas, and when a wave hit us broadside, I was jostled overboard and swept away. I thought my crew would have come to find me by now, but yours is the first ship I've seen pass by here. Did the boys send you looking for me? No. Oh, well, I'm sure they're out looking anyways. Can you get me to Little Marrow, stranger? I will be able to catch them there when the next stop by. Yeah, I'll take you to Little Marrow. Come on, pal. The castaway climbs on board. Cool. Just grab this as well. I know, I've got a starving man who desperately needs to get back to civilization, but it's not going to stop me going fishing for a really cool plate. Oh, it got dark. Let me just uh, turn the old lights on. I feel like I'm in oh, another cool rock to touch. I feel like I'm in special extra danger of running into rocks now that my boat is this much faster. I think maybe another light upgrade should be on the on the books, get that super powerful one. Although I don't think I can actually fit it yet. I think I need more space for lights first. Am I even going the right way here? No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm around the back of Little Marrow at the moment. It's fine, I'm so fast. I'm so fast that nothing is a threat anymore. I'm the threat. I'm the god of these seas. I'm gonna catch some squid. Just because they're shiny and it, it's kinda of hard to turn down anything shiny. It doesn't like seem it does seem like you get more like trophies and aberrations and stuff in shiny schools, but that seems to be all it does. Like it's not like it's you must fish this. It's imperative to fish this. 
but yeah, I see something shiny and I just have- oh, shiny. I just have to go for it. My brain is hardwired that way. Gamer that I am. Okay, this is going to take a little bit of finagling if we want to get more than one of these on board, isn't it? He's a cool little fella. Is there any chance of getting a third one? Probably not, right? That didn't help anything at all. <laughs> that made sense in my brain to, to make some space, but that it... In practice, no, that's not how that works. <laughs> I could move that there, that there. And then if I could do something with this plate. I, I think we're just going to have to... There's not even any more to fish. What am I doing? There's, not, there's nothing to be gained from doing that. <laughs> Fuck's sake, man. Ah, sweet rank smell of civilization. I thought I'd never miss it. It turns to you. For someone who has just been saved, he seems gloomly. Gloomly, yeah. I've not got much on me, as you can imagine, and I have a feeling this isn't worth much anymore, but for me at least. But perhaps it's worth something to you. He removes a signet ring from his left hand and presses it into yours. It's emblazoned with a symbol of the captain's wheel. Thanks, I will vend it. On to better horizons, friend. Farewell. Buy my shit. Thank you. Oh. Also, while I'm here. I just I just want to get rid of this flag. I don't want to equip it. I like my current one. Thank you. It's been a pleasure. Now I've got to go sell fish as well. I guess we'll have to see the next zone next time because it's definitely done. We're definitely done here. I was hoping I could squeeze in a quick visit to the new zone, but I think uh, I think we need to wrap up. So um, thanks as ever for tuning in to this wonderful show that we call YouTube, and um, I'll see you next time. Bye.